Russian volunteers collected humanitarian aid worth more than a million rubles and loaded it into a military Kamaz vehicle to be delivered to Russian servicemen in Ukraine's Luhansk region. However, the aid was not delivered to the Russian position due to an attack by a Ukrainian drone that dropped an incendiary mixture on it. Following this, the humanitarian aid burned along with the truck transporting it. A projectile fired from the drone hit the vehicle in the front row of the convoy of several Kamaz trucks, causing an explosion. The vehicle with gas cylinders caught fire while it was moving. As a result, in addition to the humanitarian aid in the vehicle, the military supplies, including the radio-electronic combat equipment also burned. Volunteers have stated that the Kamaz vehicle belonging to the military unit needs to be repaired. They also stated that they would collect aid to buy new radio-electronic combat equipment to replace the destroyed one. It should be noted that most of the territory of Luhansk region is under Russian occupation. Пошел в один. Вы пидорасы кого взяли? Вы пидорасы, сука. А? Ублюдки, сука, э. Братишка, вот это сделал ему. Ukrainian troops have captured yet another village in Russia's Kursk region after making an incursion into the Russian territory on August 6 and advancing in the area. Images of Ukrainian fighters planting a flag in Gaivo settlement of Sudza district in Kursk region have been circulated on Telegram channels. The footage showing Ukrainian fighters planting a flag on the building of the local office of Gazprom company in Sudza has also been published. It should be noted that the attack on Kursk region is the largest scale Ukrainian ground offensive on Russian territory since the start of the full-fledged war in February 2022.